In project view of the TIA portal project, expand the drive element listing in the project tree. Under the drive element, double click online and diagnostics. And click the go online button. The drive is now online with the PG. From the menu tree in the online and diagnostics screen, expand the functions listing and click the backing up and reset listing. Expand the options in the restore factory settings section. Note that there are options to reset the standard parameter set or the safety parameter set. If safety parameters have been configured, a safety reset is required before the standard parameter reset can be carried out. There are no safety parameters configured in the example, so a standard parameter reset will be performed. Click the Start button. The Restore Factory Setting pop-up appears. You have the option to save the factory settings to ROM when the reset completes. Click the checkbox to save factory settings in EEPROM if desired. Click OK to confirm. The factory reset is complete. If desired, you can access pertinent information regarding the drive. Expand the Diagnostics menu and click Diagnostics General. All of the pertinent drive information is displayed. We can now close the Online and Diagnostics window. We now want to configure the drive with the parameter set stored in the TIA portal project. Right-click the drive element in the project tree. Click Download to Device and select the desired options. The drive data is compiled in preparation for downloading. When compiling is complete, click the Load button. Note the checkbox with the option to save the parameter set to ROM when the download is complete. The information window returns a message that downloading is complete with zero errors and zero warnings. The drive has been reset to factory settings and reconfigured from the TIA portal project.